This is Culture Girl, and we're in the galleries of Crystal Bridges Museum of American Art, and we're here talking with Kevin Murphy, the curator of American art at the museum. When I was here last in May, he tantalized the press talking about an acquisition that he had just made. He wouldn't tell us what it was. He said it had to do with the Civil War, and it was by an artist who we probably didn't know and, and had a very fascinating story behind it. Now we get to see it in person. Uh, tell us what it is and why it is that you found it so intriguing. It's a painting by George Pettit, who is a, uh, uh, was a Philadelphia-based artist uh, who is very little known today, um, but was an artist who did uh, portraits and then also historical and uh, mythological subjects, exhibited at the Pennsylvania Academy quite a bit in the 19th century. Um, this is a painting called Union Refugees that he did in 1865. It's a work that's undergoing sort of active research, and one of the things that, that, that I particularly liked about coming to Crystal Bridges is that um, there are paintings and there's works here that, that because of the, 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 the way in which the collection was built quickly over time, there's a lot of room for research, which is something that, that curators like a lot. Um, and this is a, a painting that we, um, I saw and brought to, um, to the other curators and to the, the, to the board and, and they agreed to, uh, to acquire it. So tell us who these people are and what it is exactly they're doing. It's a little mysterious and, yeah. and there's some ambiguity here. So, exactly. so give us a sense of that. So the Union Refugees typically in, in literature of the time refers to it in, in stories of Harper's and other places, refers to people who were Union sympathizers but who were behind Confederate lines. Okay. Um, and I thought that was really interesting given where we are in, in, in geographically in America in Arkansas, um, which has a, a sort of complicated re relationship to the war. A major battle was fought nearby, mm -hmm. um, and there was a lot of refugee movement. There were a lot of Union sympathizers here in this region um, and in Missouri, and a lot of them sort of tried to make their way to St. Louis. Um, so I thought it was really interesting in that way. I also thought that, that, that as a painting of war, it was interesting because it really, it's, it's sort of universal. It's about the suffering dis and displacement that, that people, um, that, you know, that, that cuts across time and cuts across place, um, and really sort of is, is one of the, the more universal facts of War, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. So the way I read this is as a it, that as an intact family, you know, multi generational family group here um, with per perhaps their their slave, um, a, 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 their, their, a, a black man who's traveling with them, um, and they're headed in, in one direction. Clearly, there's sort of a reference to the plight of Egypt here. Um, but what's interesting is certain you pick up on certain details. Uh, every one of them has kind of a different way that they're thinking about the journey. Uh, the boy thinks about it as you know, he's, he's upright, his carriage is upright. Um, it looks like he's going on a grand adventure. Mm -hmm. um, the other figures seem more resigned, and the dog um, is probably you know is, is one of the most most intriguing things of the painting in a way because clearly doesn't want to go that way. Um, <laughs> so it's you know it's sort of back <laughs> on and, uh, and with the tongue sticking out. Through, uh, um, so <laughs> I read this group is going heading in one direction, and then this group I read is separate from. The group here, yes. uh, fatherless, um, you know, so either a you know, conjecture of being either the father's fighting or, or is no longer living. Yes. Um, the boy is wearing what looks a lot like the the, the Union cap, the cap that Union soldiers wore, uh, and is carrying a canteen, which also sort of you know often is, is uh, you know one would think of uh, in reference to, to the soldier's uniform, and he's pointing in another direction. So mm -hmm. I, I see the groups as potentially split. Um, and, and wondering where to go, wondering what to do, what the, what the sort of, what the, the what, where they're going to, to, to find sort of safe harbor um, during uh, this, the conflict. There, there's smoke here in the background, uh, which is probably their, the town um, where they've been, huh. they've been, where they're fleeing. Yes. Um, and I think, so I, I, I like that there's this idea that the groups are being split, that they're not monolithic. Um, and one might read that you know, this group is going perhaps you know, south, this group going north, um, because of the, the sort of the iconography of the clothing. Um, so they may not be fleeing, real, they may not be fleeing behind Union lines, they may be going south here to the con some, Confederates, I mean, we some, don't know. Exactly, no, I mean, I think that, that and that's the thing, I mean, when, so, um, you know, I, and I love, uh, I mean, for me, it, uh, you know, I love art that has, that has unanswered questions. Um, yes. and I think that there's a real ambiguity in the way that, um, that these two groups are, are split. And there's a, the, so there's a lot of questions. Um, you know, I'm wondering if Pettit is referencing a specific event, um, if he was, you know, this almost looks like it sort of it has an illustration quality to it. I'm wondering whether you know, he, was, he, was, he was doing something that's uh, you know, based on a specific story, based on a specific battle. 
Um, so there's a lot of work left to be done, and, uh, and there's uh, the, you know there's uh, one of the things about Crystal Bridges I think is that um, yeah that, that that I'm hoping that this that, that Crystal Bridges does become a place where um, that that where paintings like this find homes and 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 we add kind of to the story of American art through works that are lesser known. Thank you very much.